click the bell icon to get latest videos from ikeda hello friends now we are going to discuss the design of vending machine so our heading is design of vending machine first of all we will formulate the assumptions according to this diagram we have used variable d and n where n is equals to nickel where n equals to nickels and d is equals to dims the value of nickels is 5 cent and value of dim is 10 cent now this vending machine gives us candy if the total value is 15 cent so if a customer deposit 20 cents then it will take a 15 cent to give us candy and it will deposit the 5 cent for the next process or it will wait for the next transaction this is the working of vending machine now for this application you have to design the vending machines according to the stat diagrams so we will design the stat diagram initially s1 is the first state this is the reset state when nothing is inserted now if dim is inserted then it will goes to state s2 and if nickel is inserted it will goes to state s3 you have to make a sum of 15 cent so in this state s2 again customer has to deposit more money so if dim is inserted it will goes to state 5 or if nickel is inserted it will goes to state s4 and gives you the respective candy now for state s3 if nickel is inserted now in the state s3 there are again chances that d that is dim is inserted it will goes to state s7 if nickel is inserted it will goes to state s6 now if both are zero then it will remain in same state again there is a possibility that if nickel is inserted it will goes to state s8 if dim is inserted it will goes to state s9 so accordingly this vending machine will work and it will give the customer respective candy now if suppose dim is inserted that is having value 10 and if nickel is inserted that is value 5 so 10 plus 5 gives you 15 cent so at s4 the customer gets its candy so in state s4 customer has deposited sufficient money to get the candy and in state s5 also customer has deposited sufficient money to get the candy that's why here outputs are 1 and if these two conditions are not there then according to this state diagram it will give the respective message this is all about the vending machine to get the candy and according to the assumptions given in the example this vending machine will work properly thank you for watching this video stay tuned with ikeda and subscribe to ikeda